the ISHRS, the Mock Berlin Wall tells a story of connection, creativity, rebuilding, which in its own way mirrors what this field is all about, bringing science and artistry together to create something lasting. With this spirit in mind, we step into the World Congress today with the brightest minds in hair restoration to gather and share the latest innovations, debate new ideas, and redefine what's possible in surgery and regenerative medicine. This morning's sessions, we begin with a deep dive into cutting edge, advanced stem cell therapies, regenerative strategies for graft survival, and even new frontiers in allogenic hair transplantation. That's essentially transplantation between two different people. Every talk offered something new to think about, a spark that makes you re-examine what you thought you already knew and things you didn't think were even possible. Now, you know me, if something catches my attention, I'm asking questions. That's the best way to start a conversation and that's how we stay learning. Between sessions, the poster hall was alive with dialogue and showcased incredible work on follicular biology, graph viability, and growth modulation. The level of innovation and collaboration here is really inspiring. One of the most meaningful moments of the day for me came at Wishers Women's Luncheon hosted by Dr. Maria Schambach with keynote speaker Dr. Gorana Epstein. Their message? Leadership, mentorship, and representation go hand in hand, and that women in hair surgery are shaping the next era in this field. Later, I explored the exhibit hall, connecting with vendors, seeing the latest tools and technologies, and learning how innovation continues to refine both precision and patient outcomes. There were all sorts of knickknacks and gadgets to explore. Later in the afternoon, we explored some masterclass ideas and topics, and the day concluded with the idea of unity. Because remember, we must always stay together as one, celebrating science, innovation, and learning. Hashtag, let's stay learning.